The people of Ghana voted for the NDC majority, but if not certain machinations, this should have happened from day one of this parliament. But you see, finally we are here. We are here to do the business of the people of Ghana. We are here to begin the process to reset our country. Our country has gone through very difficult times. In fact, oftentimes, they have blamed, the people of Ghana have blamed parliament for not standing up for the people of Ghana. But obviously, you can't blame the NDC minority because we are not having the working majority. Today, we have the working majority. And we will begin the process to reset our country. We want to use this opportunity to assure the people of Ghana that the NDC majority will stand for the people of Ghana any day, any time. We will begin the process to move to the majority side and elect a new second deputy speaker on Tuesday. We assure the people of Ghana that we'll also take over majority of the committees of parliament. Yes. And we'll do the work in a way that will benefit the people of Ghana. Ghana. Yes. We have gone through so much, yes. so much as a country, and this cannot continue. We thank the speaker for standing with the people of Ghana, respecting the constitution of the Republic of Ghana, respecting precedent and the standing order of the people of Ghana, of, of the parliament of Ghana. You know, all of this, we thank the people of Ghana by standing for, 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 the, for the people of Ghana. Thank you very much. Yeah. 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 No question. Thank you. No question.